God knows how unimaginably bad his rants on Frozen 3 and 4 are going to be. What's next to Trolls Band Together Fan 2001, aka Alex? You're going to call them the worst movie of all time? Hey guys, Harry Thomas here, and I promised my good pal and uh, uh, subscriber Frozen Thing Studios a... a uh, reaction to what is not only the worst uh, rant video I have ever seen, period, uh, but the worst YouTube video I have ever seen in my entire life, period. Like, uh, I'm sorry, but uh, uh, I, I, I uh, it hated uh, his uh, Across the Spider-Verse rant last year. That at the time was the worst uh, rant uh, ever, and even his Wisher rant was just unjustified, and, well, and not to mention his Skyfall rant, his No Time to Die rant, where he heartlessly applauded at Bond's death, and uh, I, uh, and, and his Incredibles 2, and uh, Lego Movie 2 rants uh, this year, and his rants on the Toy Story series, and you know why he's hating all these movies? All because people love them and praise them more than the Trolls franchise. Wow, is that immature uh, or what? <laughs> so, yeah, <laughs> let's uh, pray I can survive uh, this, uh, well, uh, excruciating rant. I, I know I won't be able to finish the entire thing before just turning it off. A toast for Frozen 2 single-handedly destroying cinema once and for all. You've got that right, Sister Elsa. Yeah, those stupid Trolls movies don't even stand a chance against us. What? What's the meaning of this, Kim Possible? You just killed my sister! Oh, I'm not Kim Possible. I'm Trolls Band Together fan, here to change your mind on the Trolls movies. Yeah, what he said. You don't know what you're talking about, troll. You're stealing our fame because you have none of your own, you big, oh, you big phony. And for all the bad stuff you said about our movies, I'm going to freaking get you. Well, oh my god, that is a mean spirit is opening to have uh, your uh, dolls of uh, Poppy and Bieber just uh, beat up uh, the dolls of Elsa and Arna. Uh, like that's and and I'm like, uh, dude, you think Frozen Two destroyed cinema? You are overreacting. Uh, like hell, like a uh, heck. Uh, Mufasa the Lion King is gonna uh, d uh destroy cinema. I I I guarantee you, way it will do way more harm than Frozen Two ever will. Uh, yeah, this uh, this is my. Uh, all my proud defense of uh, Frozen 2, the greatest Disney sequel, and why Alex is very wrong to continue to beat a dead horse with his raw hatred for an unjustified hatred for this movie. If I hadn't have said, oh, uh, if I hadn't have said I didn't like Wreck It Ralph, and if I didn't say, oh, Frozen 2 is my second favorite Disney movie, second only to Lion King, he wouldn't be. Uh, uh, consistently hating Frozen 2 this much for the past four years, but uh, the hate has gotten out of hand. He he needs uh, to stop this disgusting, toxic behaviour. Anyways, take that, Elsa, because Troll kicks ass. Yeah, thank you, Poppy. Damn, bro, you just wasted your money on that uh, Elsa doll, and uh, how uh, heartless is that to uh, flush her down the toilet? You don't see me buying Trolls merchandise just to, uh, you know, chop the heads off Troll dolls or uh, chuck them down the toilet. I mean, I am not perfect and not a saint. Every movie reviewer user is flawed, but at least I don't wish death on the trolls' characters. Like you wish death on the frozen characters, uh, uh, which is uh, pure evil. And uh, and 
and Elsa did not deserve that, no matter what you fucking say. Well guys, this is it. The big one. The shit stopper. The constipation of American cinema. A bowel blockage of which any value can possibly be removed. But y'all, guess what? I now think this is the worst movie of all time. Oh, here we go again. We freaking get it. You have uh, said Frozen 2 is your least favorite movie of all time for the past four years. You have forced it uh, uh, down our throats uh, to the point where we're sick of it. Frozen 2. Yes, for the past five years. I never got why I won so many people over. How does it have a big community led by that shitty user that we don't speak of? It's fine if you don't like Frozen 2, uh, but to go as far as calling it the worst movie of all time, uh, that uh, is uh, uh, just uh, outrageous and uh, not a good point. Your opinion is not coming from uh, uh, you judging the movie fairly, it's coming from your uh, uh, sheer bias, uh, the fact that you, uh, you've got to, uh, hate uh, anything that isn't trolls and, uh, and rant on every single user that's, uh, gave, uh, trolls, uh, band together a negative review, myself included, and will you also stop bullying Lambo Rock Strikes Back and my friend Frozen 2 fan? Hey, how dare you talk about Frozen Things Studios uh, that way, and, and your rant on him in 2022, oh, that uh, was uh, cringe and uh, uh, so heartless of you. Uh, Alex, I can't believe I was once your friend. I, I'm glad I have cut ties with, with you now entirely. But does it deserve any positives? Fuck no, it does not! If you think of any good thing in Frozen 2, then I'm sorry. You do not deserve to be a professional movie critic. You don't deserve to work in the film industry. And truth be told, you hate movies. That's right. You hate good movies. It is literally the number one form of execution. Oh, and uh, uh, stop uh, uh bashing anybody that likes Frozen 2 and saying they don't deserve to work in the film industry because uh, they do. Who cares if they uh, have different thoughts on the movie to you? Writing felt like it was written on friggin' toilet paper. Frozen 2 literally has the shittiest, worst written script I have ever seen in any movie. When you literally just have Elsa just uh, finding a sound that... Uh, sound there that is one of the worst sounds i have ever heard in my life whenever i hear that uh, oh my goodness blood drips out of my ears it was so torturous to listen to i know i listen to a fire alarm didn't listen to this and yeah when you have that the plot of uh, her finding elsa finding the sound guys and finding out what that is and just you know, all the characters just doing jack shit that is literally a sign that you gave up in writing process. Sure, kids and adults will be fucking bored out of their minds through throughout this movie. Yeah, this is the biggest fucking gore fest I have ever seen. It was so fucking boring. Boring. There was a family behind me who brought their kids to see Frozen 2. And uh, I look back like 30 minutes into the movie. I look back at them and guess what? They're gone. They took their kids and they didn't even come back! And no, the script uh, was uh, nowhere near as bad as you say, and Elsa was not just on a, off on a bad quest, and the other characters were not just doing jack shit. Did you watch the movie? There was a purpose to why they all needed to leave Arendelle and go to the Enchanted Forest to Utter Holland to save Arendelle. Arendelle had no future until they did so. Oh, you're just a straight up copying a Black Crisset guy's uh, rant on Norm of the North, uh, just like you uh, like to steal and copy quotes uh, from my videos. Uh, it astounds me you have uh, over 2,000 subscribers and your videos get all the views when they are the most unoriginal, uh, uh, biggest rip-off videos I have ever seen. Everybody has been saying, oh, at the end 
animation is absolutely gorgeous. It's so beautiful. It is some of the best animation I've ever seen in my life. Well, I gotta say, fuck off, people. That's right, fuck off. The animation in Frozen 2 is horrible. The animators literally put zero effort in the animation. Like Elsa's ice powers looks like it came straight out of a PS2 game. The backgrounds look so unfinished. Like, uh, there's scenes like the characters or, or like standing behind a green screen. It's just so unfinished. It's like the backgrounds was like made in like only 10 minutes. And all the locations are so fucking boring. Like the majority of this movie just takes place in a woods. Yeah, that's right. A freaking uninspired and boring woods. Atta Holland just looks like a fucking video game location. Like, I don't want to be in this fucking boring world. I'd rather be in a better location like a sunny place like Fake A Island. Or an upbeat world like Mount Rages. Not a shitty, boring ass woods. Damn, uh, dude. Uh, uh, you, there's no need to punch the camera. Uh, uh, no, no need to, uh, 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 throw your toys out of the pram just because people like the beautiful and stunning animation of Frozen 2. In uh, fact, uh, I would uh, far rather spend a day in the Enchanted Forest and Usa Holland than uh, any of the uh, 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 gl overly glitter trolls locations and- Oh god, I just wanna throw him into the fires of Mount Doom for all I can- Holy shit, you just wanna straight up murder Olaf by- Throwing him into the piss of love. Oh my god, and what did Olaf ever do to you? Basically, the most forgettable and nothing of a villain in the entire Disney pantheon. Best way to sum it up. Kristoff is a fucking creepy stalker who just wants to fuck on all the time. In the North Ultra people, well, no one gives a fuck or motherfucking shit about the North Ultra people. Not one, two, three, or four either. No one even five either. Not even six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve either. And of course, Anna and Elsa, they are the worst fucking duo, animated duos of all time. They are horrible sisters. They don't even show any love to each other at all or any support to each other. Even Anna is like so uh, protect overprotective towards Elsa. For just uh, let's uh, uh, pull off and Anna go on the boat down the river and I'm like, fuck off Elsa, you're a horrible sister there. You just literally just want to let her go for her own selfish needs and also to go on her shitty quest to find her mom. But you know what fucking pisses me off, guys? People out there soullessly compare Anna and Elsa to Poppy and Eva. Hey, is not a stalker. Uh, he uh, uh, just uh, wants her to uh, be there for Anna and her sister, and he just uh, can't find the appropriate time to propose to her. He would never stalk her. And shut the fuck up about uh, your hate for Elsa and Anna already. They uh, uh, do not look uh, scary. They Heck, you are more scary in this rant video than they ever were. Elsa and Anna uh, are not assholes. Arno is rightfully protective of her sister because she nearly lost her in the first movie. And uh, did you not see the beautiful scene where they where they uh, hugged her together in their old bedroom? And Elsa was not selfish or, or a dick uh, by any means to send out. Anna and Olaf uh, away while she went to Ossa Holland alone. She did the right thing. She saved Anna and Olaf's lives. There was no way they could have crossed the perilous oceans to Ossa Holland. Like Elsa's character arc. And honestly, you know what? I'm not even going to refer to this bitch as Elsa, guys. I'm not referring to this poor as Elsa. No. You know who she is? She's fucking Miss Lex. Yep, guys. Sure, she's actually Miss Lex. Who's Miss Lex, you may ask? Well, it's the shitty teacher that uh, Jules Matt Forever uh, has to deal with when she goes to school all the time. And yeah, I actually have to compare her to a strict teacher in real life. And yeah, her design is horrible and just fuck whoever designed her. And also fuck her dress. Her and calling Elsa a bitch and a whore, I mean, going way too far, you, you, you big bully. Uh, like, uh, like her design uh, looks uh, 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 looks uh, totally gorgeous, no matter what you say. Some of the shittiest songs I have ever listened to. Not exactly.
exaggeration. Like Queen Adonna song in the opening, her lullaby. Oh, God, when she's like, I'm like, shut up, shut up, shut up! The opening song in Arendelle was horrible. Into the Unknown was abominably atrocious! Especially the refrain at the end credits by Panic and Disco. I'm like, no, why? Panic and Disco, why? Why would you make this song? Why? You made it! I'm ready to go. You know, from the Smurf credits back in 2011. Why did you change from a great song like that to this shitty, atrocious song like that? Lost in the Woods was so traumatizing. Just the choreography was just so shitty, and especially when Sven and the reindeer were singing. I'm like, oh, God. Those reindeer look fucking horrendous. When they started singing, I was like... <laughs> Reindeer season comes sooner because I just wanted to shoot all these reindeer in this movie. Show yourself. Oh, fucking shit, folks. No, no, not show yourself. More like go fuck yourself. Yeah, it is the shittiest fucking song I have ever heard in my life. And her singing was so scary. shut the hell up about uh, the songs uh i at least uh, the songs in frozen 2 i uh, have a glamour to them and uh, and uh, some even weren't afraid to go dark like the next right thing and uh, and uh, really get the feels going unlike the troll songs which are just a bunch of glisser uh, n nonsense uh, In Dune, uh, appearing before Elsa and Ossa Holland is not uh, copying Mufasa's ghost uh, fr from Lion King. Iduna wasn't telling Elsa to go back to Arendelle and take your place on the throne like Mufasa was telling Simba to get his ass uh, back uh, to, to Pride Rock or, or anything. And, uh, and stop putting your freaking troll uh, action figures and dolls in... Uh, in uh, literally uh, every uh, scene in your videos like even your thumbnails uh, are you just uh, overuse uh, the trolls uh, like Okay, headphone users be warned, uh, because uh, I felt like I was deaf after hearing his uh, childish uh, scream. I don't see how that uh, climax uh, is uh, bad, or, or the worst ever whatsoever. Shock factor to us, and, uh, uh, and uh, uh, gave us goosebumps, unlike uh, the non-existent climax of, say, Fant Forstick. Oh, dude, for Pete's sake, uh, this ladies beware of Trolls Band Together fan everybody. Like, what woman would want to have children with uh, this man who just overly obsesses with trolls and treats trolls like it's better than everything in the universe and hates the Frozen characters like they're worse than the devil and Hitler and, and, uh, you're, and you shouldn't force your kids to uh, watch trolls. You're like, uh, 
uh, JB's dad in Tenacious D, where he's like, Gotta praise the Lord when you're in my home. Well, you're like, a gotta praise trolls when you're in your home. Your kids are capable of making their own decisions, and if they want to watch Frozen, let them. Oh, you, you burnt the DVD. That's it. I'm done. I'm not watching any more of this rant. I can't take it anymore. I, I, I want out. That is fucking evil. Like, and plus you wasted your money again. I mean, you don't see me going out to buy Trolls DVDs to burn them, uh, do, do you? Oh, and you wanting to shoot the reindeer in Lost in the Woods. That is unfair. Fathomable, like only a poacher or an animal abuser would would do that. Uh, so, yeah, uh, uh, let's just say uh, Disney is never gonna hire you as an animator, Buzzy, if you continue to behave uh, th this way. I mean, yeah, uh, you, uh, yeah, when Fro Frozen three and four are happening, Buzz, accept it and. Boy, do you need to change your ways going forward, but he is not likely to listen. He has had more rants made about him than literally any other YouTube user, and, uh, and you know what, uh, you can hardly blame them, uh, for the, for how many enemies he has met, he's, uh, so, yeah, I'm just thankful I am nothing like him, and, uh, I, uh, and I hope uh, my good friend Frozen Things Studios uh, has recovered from that uh, diabolical rant that we both had to sit through. Well, I love you guys. Thank you all for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, my reaction. And do you agree that uh, Alex's rant on Frozen 2 is uh, his worst rant video uh, yet? Please comment and let me know. Please like this video and subscribe. Please follow on Twitter and on Instagram. And I'll see you all next time. And remember, movies are us. Bye, guys.